Welcome back, everybody. It is time for another Sunday booster cracking. Let's lock this thing down. We've got Alice Origins 3 out uh, last week, I believe. It just came out. So this is like my first box that I've actually paid like full price for, uh, which is pretty crazy. But uh, one thing about this box that I'm not too fond of is it only has 20 packs instead of the regular like big 36 i guess the next set will have 36 again so i don't know if that's something they're just testing out and switching up but this one only has 20 packs so we're going to be opening the whole thing today uh it does come with a nice uh promo box topper card as well you can get like one of three nice j rulers uh i'm hoping to get arla because he looks really sweet so yeah there's some uh there's some cool cards in here so let's open this thing up and see what we can find there we go all this plastic off in this nice little tiny box little mini box this time boom oh look at that straight on the top we got arla as our box topper yes that is fantastic uh yep definitely the one i wanted to get he looks sweet he looks really sweet i think he's the best uh one you can get uh in my opinion the other ones are cool too but like he's awesome looking so i am pretty happy about that we'll leave him sealed for now and we'll set up our little box here. All right, Alice Origins 3. I haven't opened any of the Alice ones yet, uh, so this will be interesting. Let's see what we can find here. Grave Robbers, very cool. There's a lot of reprints in this set from what I've seen, a few of them. So we might see some stuff from like older sets, like uh, She's a Reprint, uh, that Undead card that we just saw was a reprint, Fire Magic Stone. And uh, one life point, thousand life points. All right, cool. I guess. I don't know. I don't know if that means anything. There's our rare uh, heroic epic as our rare. Very cool. Behind it, we got a nice magic stone of dusting skies rare foil full art. Awesome. Into the next one here. Let's see this thing. Uh, another grave robber. Reflection summoning spiral spiral of potential and convergence. There's another card of her that's a rare, I believe, or a super rare that's pretty sweet. Spirit of Passion, Rena, Griffin, Light Magic Stone, another life point. I guess these are like our tokens now for this set. Will O the Wisp as our rare, the Stranger card. Pretty lame looking. And we got the Twilight Witch Stranger as our rare full art. Very nice. Very cool looking. I haven't seen that card actually. All right, into the next one here. One card I would like to get in a full art foil would be Artemis, the God Bow or something like that. Uh, she's a really cool card, so I'm hoping to get her. But we shall see. Magna's Angel. There's another reference, I believe. Wind Magic Stone. A Will Coin. And behind it, the Jabberwock. The Jabberwock. The Chaotic Disaster as our rare. And behind that, the White Gale Eagle Rare Foil. Nice. I say nice like I actually like the Eagles, but I really don't like the Eagles. <laughs> I'm never a fan of any of the Eagles. <laughs> All right. Ah, there we go. Uh, Garden of Amalia. Another reprint. Reflect. Herald of Winged Lord. That's a reprint. Uh, Cross of Darkness. Magic Stone. Uh, Life Point. And there we go, we got the eagle as our rare behind it, the Herald of the Wing Lord Full Art Foil. Uh, just a common, I believe, or uncommon. It's got a different marking, it's got an N this time. So that's weird, but uh, nice full art, looks really good. Yeah, this set's a little different. Every, every of the other cards besides the rares and stuff have an N. So even like the commons, I guess, they all have N. So I don't know what that means, but oh well, we can kind of figure it out. Arthur, very nice. I believe he was a rare before, uh, so that's surprising. Wind Magic Stone, oh, that's a nice one. I like how all these are full arts just for the Magic Stones. All right, behind it, we've got a token. Oh, a Resonator Beast token, interesting. And behind that, Heavenly Flash as our super rare. Very nice super rare, more Arla artwork, very good. The artwork on, uh, the guy who does the artwork for these is really nice, he's got a good style, I like it. And for uh, Farika's Journey, Erica's Journey, Journey, just a common, I guess you could call it, but a uh, pretty nice one. Oh, there we go. All right, Black Wizard, the Stranger, Spiral of Potential, Blood Angel, Knight, Gatekeeper, Fire Magic Stone, a Life Point, 
and Change of Heart as our super rare prequel artwork on that one. Behind it, Magna's Angel, just an uncommon, but a nice one to get. That one's pretty sweet. Well, I'm hoping that the value will be here in this box. Um, you know, I, I always try to just get these Force of Wills on sale, but since this is the first one I got at full price, I'm hoping we make our money back on it. Uh, Morning Angel, that'd be a cool one to get in the full art. Darkness Magic Stone, a life point. And Rhea, very nice, our super rare Resonator Vampire. Uh, decent artwork. Uh, I don't like the pose so much, though. And behind it, Give Wings. Very nice artwork. Very cool. Into the next pack. Let's get our Soulless Soldier out of the way and into the Realm of the Dead with the Crystallization and the Release and the Illusionary and the Spirit of Calmness. And I think that's like our third Darkness Magic Stone in a row. A nice life point. Magic Stone of Earth's Core, Hearth's Core, as our rare. And behind it, the Sacred Beast of Artemis. Artemis is like the Vivian of Force of Will, basically, I guess. So this is our secret rare, but a nice full art of it. Boom. Armala, Cathedral. Ooh, that's nice. Let's see that. Uh, Guardian of the Deep Blue. Nice colors on that one. Uh, Spirit of Passion, Residence, Fallen Angel, Fire Magic Stone, a Will Coin. Uh, we got Michael, the Archangel as a Stranger. Very cool. That's our rare. This is the, the same setup as the Artemis one. Uh, I don't know how I feel about these border things. I think they take away a lot. Even on the full arts, they still have kind of these borders. Uh, so I don't know how I feel about that. But behind it, we've got a rare, the res Resistance of the Twelve Protective Deities. Wow, that's some, uh, that's some neat artwork. I like that. Everybody's fighting. Really cool. Alright. Vampire's Staff. Alice. Cell. Knight. Seraph. There's another reprint. We know her from a few sets. Snow White. Willcoin. And we got Freya, the Goddess of Abundance, as our Stranger Super Rare. Very nice, very nice. Behind it, a Soulless Soldier. Probably not a big deal. Leave a like if you're enjoying the Force of Will. I've got all these boxes behind me, and we'll probably be taking polls in the upcoming weeks to see which one we're going to open up next. So follow me on Instagram at Lockdown51, uh, TikTok at Lockdown5151. We'll be doing some polls and stuff to see which ones we go into next. Celestial Wing Seraph, again, the end here, but this, I believe, was a rare before. We pulled her in the foil stamped in Twilight Wander, I believe, or one of those. All right, life points, and then we got Pierre, the Godspeed Archer. Not a fan of this guy's artwork, but, you know, it's a super rare, okay. Moan of the Dead. Sure, the Moan of the Dead. What a weird name to call your card. All right, Omala, Release, Morgana, Wingman, Angel, Blue Magic Stone, a life point, and nice, we got Teller of Heroic Epics as our super rare. She's a cool card in the full art, a nice wanderer. Alice Castling as our full art. All right, let's keep going. Give Wings, not bad, not bad, not bad. Uh, Crime and Punishment, Gatekeeper, and Light Magic Stone, Life Point, and Apollyon. He's pretty cool looking. The God of Light, Stranger, Rare. Uh, yeah, he's got some cool artwork. He's like sitting. So is he standing or sitting? He looks like he's sitting just on his big wolf creature. It's kind of rude, man. And a Will of Wisp, Full Art Stranger for our rare. Pretty cool. Into the next pack. Soul the Soldier, Castling, Moan of the Dead, Resident, Prissia. Water Magic Stone, nice token zombie where we got the resistance, uh, just like the regular version this time, and behind it, a nice super rare change of heart that looks super cool in a full art, excellent. All right, Armala again, we got a bunch of those cathedrals. This is a small set, I think there's only like 150, 130 cards, so that's why we're seeing so many doubles. Uh, Earthly Flesh as our rare, Behind it, ooh, that's nice. And Arthur, the Dead Lord of Vengeance, full art. He looks really sweet in a full art. Even better than uh, the original version, I think. This full art looks a little bit nicer, a little bit more full. Cruising through. I think we've only got like three packs left or something like that. Uh, but that's what happens when you get like these smaller boxes, so. All right, Herald, Illusionary, Snow White, Magic Stone, and then we got Foss, the Promising Warrior Stranger, as our super rare, super rare. 
and a Spirit of Passion full art. Crack it open. Give wings. Vampire Staff. Arthur. And Percival the Flying Knight as our rare. Ooh, that's a good one. We got Frigga the Goddess of Abundance super rare full art. You can see what I'm talking about here. They still have this like order. Like, why didn't you just take just take this part out right here to make it a nicer full art? You're cropping the picture. I don't get it. It's supposed to be a full art. But I'll take it. That's good. That's not bad. All right. Another Armala. Blood. N. Riona. Whatever her name is. Morgana. Light Magic Stone. And Between Passion and Calmness as our super rare. Very nice. It's Major Art Chant. Very cool. Behind it. Ooh, a nice full art of... What is her name? Anorite. The Guardian of the Deep Blue. I'm, I'm fine with that. That one looks really cool in a, in a foil. That blue, those blues though, those blues pop. Wow, one, two, two more packs. All right, let's get into it here. Give us some good final pulls. Let's see. Boom, Charlotte, the sleeping girl in the castle as our rare, probably not that great. And a rare full art of Mikaje Sichiro, whatever his name is, he's got some interesting artwork. All right, I, I don't know what he goes for, but I'll take it. Last one. Give us the goods. Let's see. End of the friendship. Refrain, spirit of calmness, dignified, another celestial wing. A token, a magic stone. Oh, I didn't want that. Was that our ma Oh, the magic stone was our rare, my bad. And then we got a, a Heavenly Garden full art, which usually these aren't worth anything. Oh well. Alright, here's our pulls of the day. We've got our nice Magic Stones, of course, our nice full art foil of one of them. That should be worth some value. These are like my sleeper hits that potentially uh, might have some value. Heavenly Flash, this Resistance card full art. Uh, Rhea, I think she's going for a couple bucks, but not sure. Will-O-Wisp, the full art. Change of Heart full art. I think this one might be worth some value. Uh, between Passion and Calmness, not sure about this one, but it might uh, have a couple bucks. And of course, the uh, full art of the Goddess of Abundance. And last but not least, our Arla box topper. Now, he's probably not worth a whole lot because he is a box topper, so there's going to be more of them in production and stuff anyways. But uh, yeah, I didn't show off the other sides the same. And now he's got wings, which uh, I would prefer two different artworks, I guess. But it is cool artwork, so... I'll take it, it's fine. But hopefully we did good. Price is up on screen now for how we did. If you enjoyed, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe for more Force of Will openings, and stay tuned. We got lots more boxes sitting behind me here. So we will see you guys in the next episode.